See, in prayer, sometimes when we want to go for sujood, if you're wearing trousers or pants, sometimes you have to lift it a little bit so that it, does, uh, it doesn't become so tight on your thigh. So you just lift it a little bit, and when you stand up, you may fix your blouse or your T-shirt or your, your, your uh, uh, shirt. Sometimes we fix our uh, head uh, uh, gear when we stand up or before going to Rukur and do this. So this movement is not plenty or a lot, yet it is movement. So would it impact the prayer? The answer is no. As long as there is a need for it, there's no problem in that. What about the, the, the schools of thought that say three move, movements in the Salat breaks it? The answer is this is baseless. So this has no foundation, neither in the Quran nor in the Sunnah. And the doing of the Prophet والسلام, certainly confirms that this is baseless. Because we know that he used to pray, as in one authentic hadith, carrying his granddaughter, Umama bint Abil As, the daughter of his daughter Zainab. May Allah be pleased with her. And whenever he went for ruku or sujood, he would place her on the ground. And whenever he stood up, he would pick her up and pray while carrying her. And this is 